everyone, it's Sweet Book Remini here, aka Gracie. Today I'm going to be doing a book review for you. And what book is that that you ask? Anna and the French Kiss by Stephanie Perkins. I just want to start this review by saying that, guys, you can read this series in any way that you want. You can read it 132, 231, any way because they're connected, but it's if they're all about different characters. I also thought it would be fun to do this review for you guys because the next book that I'm actually reading is Lola and the Boy Next Door and I'm really excited for this one although I've actually heard some mixed things about this book. By all means guys comment down below if you have heard anything about it or if you've read it so please tell me what you think of that book. Also if you've read Anne and the French Kiss and Isla and the Boy Next Door feel free to comment down below and tell me what you thought of them. So this review is kind of going to be both my review and the summary of the book so I'm gonna start with the review. I really liked this book because it was like it was pretty realistic It's a teen fiction contemporary and it was really sweet and really realistic And it was sort of about fitting in and wanting to make friends as well as adventure and your first love So it was a really sweet book and 100% I recommend it for everybody Got a good look at it. I also really love the cover. It's real It's really pretty and girly and you can really tell that it's all about France and the title guys the title is so sweet. The title is really well thought of and just in general this is a good book. So now I'm going to do the summary of the book. The main character's name is Anna and she is, I don't remember exactly which year in high school she is. I think she's going into either grade. I don't remember guys. I don't, I'm sorry. I don't remember which grade she's going into. I haven't, re I read this book quite a while ago so I can't remember and I don't just want to guess. I know it's not a really vital point in the story but I don't want to guess. So you're gonna have to find out for yourself. I'm just kidding. It's about Anna and she she's in high school. Don't know what year. Don't know what age. But this, I keep getting distracted guys. By the way if you have been wondering why this like bulb is here it's my lamp and oh I can't grab it. And usually I use it for like lighting but I'm kind of liking the light in here. It's kind of giving me that glow that I need so that's why you just see like a bulb sitting here. Back to Anna and the French Kiss. Wow, I'm so distracted today, guys. This is bad. I don't know why. I think it's because I got like an hour of sleep last night. I'm like really, really tired. Coming back to Earth now. So yeah, Anna and the French Kiss is about Anna, and she yeah uh, she doesn't know what she really wants to do with her life. And she one fun fact about Anna is that she loves films and she loves movies and she loves everything about the cinema. And that was one of my favorite things about her. So just wanted to throw that in there for you guys because you guys should know all about this girl because the character Anna is awesome like she's really really cool back to the review again Anna's dad thought it would be a really fun and educational idea for her to go to France for, for one of her years in high school and Anna didn't want to go to France what what why Anna what are you doing what are you why wouldn't you want to go to France free of charge girl free of charge anywho she does eventually suck it up and says yeah sure I'll go to France she goes and the first person she meets there isn't her roommate but it's the person who lives next door to her which is named Meredith and Meredith is super friendly super fun and she's kind of the girlfriend that everybody wants and everybody just needs because Meredith is so sweet funny athletic she lets you borrow her stuff like she's the girlfriend that everybody dreams of she stays in her bedroom like really really late in her dorm room and she just like rubbishes through all of her stuff and I thought that was so cute. She goes through all of her things and then she looks at the clock and she realizes it's like 12 or 1 a.m. So she decides okay like it's time for her to go to bed go to bed and go back to her dorm room and settle in in her own room and on her way out she meets the creature. She meets St. Clair and St. Clair is like a beautiful man that she like instantly is like whoa he's so good looking so she meets him and they exchange a friendly laugh and talks and you know those flirty eyes I can't do them obviously cuz uh, yeah I can't Meredith also tells her the next day like that she can go and meet her crew and meet all of her friends and have lunch and breakfast and by the way this school that they're going to is pretty much like the grand hall or like the Grand Budapest Hotel because it's like like you go there and you get like five star food and it's like you go to my old high school and you get like fries. <laughs> so the next day she goes and uh, she meets all of the gang which includes Rashmi, Josh, Saint Clair, and Meredith herself and soon to be Anna 
and um, Anna gets to know St. Clair a little bit more, which is really sweet, and then they start to study together, hang out together, and just talk together, and I think they start to text as well, or email or something like that, but yeah, they start to communicate a lot more. I don't want to say any more because I don't want to, I don't want to leak anything out, but yeah, this book is really, really cute, and let me just tell you, like, you will like it. You will like, you, you just don't dislike it. This book is really likable. It's sweet. It's a light read as well. Like, it's it's not hard to stay focused with this book. It's really easy, and it's just a great book in general. So yeah, definitely read it, guys. And you will like all of the characters. You'll end up liking them. Actually, my, my least favorite character is Rashmi, and you guys will see why when you read this book. All right, guys, you've reached the end of this video. Thank you guys for watching, and don't forget to hit subscribe the button down below, and don't forget to leave any comments in the area below. Don't forget to check out all of the links in the description box. And thank you for watching, guys. I'll be back tomorrow with another video. Tell me in the comments if you would like any type of video. Thank you guys for watching so much. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you. Bye!